campeonato. Maybe I should start. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm laughing because I literally just filmed a video and I made no sense. I couldn't speak. I was mixing up my words. <laughs> so I'm going to redo it. Because it was really bad. You ever have one of those days where you just can't speak and the video was just like not what you wanted it to be at all? It was crazy. All right, so what I'm gonna do today is my August favorites. Can you believe August is over already? How fast did that summer go? I cannot even take it. The fact that school started already is unbelievable. But there are a few products that I could not live without this past month and I wanted to share them with you guys. All right, so if you guys would like to see my August favorites, then just keep watching. All right, so the first product I'm going to show you guys is from the Bath & Body Works lotion line, I guess. This is um, called Beautiful Day. I actually had the big bottle of this. It is now gone. So now I have a small bottle, and it smells so good. Like, I'll be using this the entire month of September myself because even though it smells like summer, it's just, it's so amazing. It has um, an apple smell to it, along with like flowers and stuff. You guys can see the bottle. Oh, it smells so good. All right, my next product I'm gonna show you guys, I got this Pure Lease. Um, this is a Gentle Soy Milk Cleanser and Makeup Remover. I got this in a, I wanna say it was a BoxyCharm. Nope, Ipsy, it was an Ipsy bag. And I absolutely love this. There's like none left in here. I used it all. And the full size bottle of this, I want to say is like $36. That is so expensive. So I'm like, eh, maybe I'm not going to buy it. But honestly, I probably will because I can see the difference in my skin just from using it. It is amazing. The next product I'm going to show you guys is the Essence Lash Princess. I don't know if you guys have seen this in a previous video that I've done. But I haven't used this mascara in a really long time. And I just happened to come across it again at um, Ulta not too long ago. So I had to buy it. And I love this mascara. I forgot why I even stopped using it. I think that I might have got a new mascara and I was testing that one out. So I just put this one off to the side and forgot all about it. But it is now back. And I have been using it all month. I love this stuff. Love it. And it's cheap too. I think it's only like 4 or $5. I don't know if you guys... That's the brush, right? It is amazing. I actually have it on my lashes today. Hello, pretty lashes. <laughs> All right, I have four more items. The next one is probably in everyone's favorites for the past two or three months. It is the Becca highlighter in Champagne Pop. It is the collaboration with Jaclyn Hill and it is the best thing since sliced bread. It is absolutely amazing. I call this highlighter life. I have it on today. It is beautiful. Ready? Do you see it? Ready? Oh my God. Oh my God. It is amazing. You can never have too much highlighter, right? Right? To my husband, I can. He's like, why is your face glowing? I'm like, leave me alone. I'm strobing right now. Leave me alone. Yes, it is life. I love this stuff. I'm honestly thinking about buying another one just so that when I run out of this, I have a backup before they're all sold out. It's worth every penny, just so you guys know if you don't have it. The next thing I'm going to pull out is the Physician's Formula... I would just say it's an eyeliner, but it's actually more. It is an eye booster, two-in-one lash boosting eyeliner and serum. I love this eyeliner. Um, who put me on to this is Caitlin Krekelwich. I swear you guys hear her name in like all my videos. I love her. Um, I saw her using this, and she still does, in almost all her videos when she's doing a winged liner. And um, I was like, that has to be good. If she uses it all the time, it has to be good. And sure enough, I went and I bought it, and it is amazing. I love this stuff. I use it for all my liners, all of them. Every time you see a wing on my face, chances are I use this to do it. Um, next thing I like, I'm really feeling this 
Funky Fingers nail polish color. This is in the color Space Cadet. What I like about this nail polish, not only um, like when I have a nice tan, it just looks really nice on the nails and on my toes, but it changes color. I don't know if you guys could see that. Right here it says inside. So basically when you're inside the house, this is the color of the nails of your nail polish. And then when you go outside or you dip it into water, like um, the beach or at the pool, it turns into like this green color. I don't know if you guys could see it, but it is awesome. I love this nail polish. It's so sad that summer's basically over. So I'm going to rock that for this month before it really gets into fall. And then I won't bring it back out until next summer. And last but not least, can you guys guess what it is? <laughs> it is the Inglot lipstick in number 282. It is my purple lipstick. It's actually lipstick, as you guys can see, that I have on right now. I love this lipstick. I got this at the makeup show that I went to with Rita. When did we go? Was it in March? No, May. Was it in May? I don't really remember when it was. The beginning of this year, sometime a few months ago. That's where I got it, and I absolutely fell in love with that color. I will repurchase that color over and over and over again. What do you guys think? Does it work for me? Is it too much? I love it. So really, no matter what you say, I'm going to like it. But I would love to know your opinions. Everyone's entitled to their opinion, right? All right, guys. So those are my August favorites. I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. And if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed yet, please do so. Hit that little red button. I don't know where it is. It's somewhere in this, either here or over here. Um, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.